So my name is Ozzy Scogan and I did electromagnetic induction. So when you have a, ba a double A battery, it has negative and positive charges. And when you put on a magnet on the bottom of the negative side, see this puts near er, negative charges in through this channels it, and then this is on the positive side to make it spin. So So what I did was I took seashells from Florida and then I got instant sea salt and you put the sea salt and mix it in the water. And it, um, I have a control group and a testing group and in the con in control group that is where the, uh, the pH level of the water right now and that's how much acid is in the water and it's 8.1 in the water and that's what it is in the ocean water so that's what we did in the control group. And the testing group we did in a couple of years, in like three years or so, uh, they think the acid level is going to be really high. So the lower, like the number, so they think it's going to be a 7.5 in the next couple of years, and that's like really bad. So that's when the ocean shells are going to start like dissolving. Yeah. Um, my name is Anne. I did this cover crop help with soil erosion. So I had four different test sites. I had live wheat that was frozen, mulch, and then just bare soil. And then I poured water over them and saw how much dirt ran off into the water. And the mulch one had like the least run off from the tests. What do you want? My name is Matt Kosky and I'm doing the science fair. This is my third, my Third, you're doing this project. Which uh, organic fertilizer is most effective for part three? And the fertilizers I'm using, I'm using green sand, which is a glaucunite, glaucunite, which is found on the bottom of the ocean, uh, organic fish, which is liquid, and then an organic kelp, which is liquid as well. So during my experiment, I had to figure out how to do my ratios for my dirt because I'm using a liquid and a solid, which that would. Was the part that kind of stumped me. So that's my little running down here. And yeah. the green sand prevailed over the organic kelp and the organic fish because it grew quicker, it sprouted faster, and it is the tallest as of now.